from World of Concrete 2018. With me now is Andy Dickey, who's Business Development Manager at Trimble. Welcome aboard. Hey, thanks for nice having me. Nice to see you. How's the show going for you? Superb. That's that the good? word I would use. Very good. Very good. That's a pretty strong statement. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I mean, we, we, we've been here so many years. We've right. seen the ups and the downs in the economy, and construction's white hot. Everybody's... Everybody's in a good mood this year, well, I think. Trimble's <laughs> been around a number of years now, haven't you? They have, and we have uh, been around since the 70s, and then uh, some of our acquisitions uh, that we've made of software companies. We've got one company that we acquired, Tecla, this is its 51st year making software, so my goodness. been doing it a little, a little while. Well, tell me a little bit about what you brought that's new to the show this year. We've got a lot of new stuff. I think uh, the most exciting thing that we have is we've, we've patented a hard hat, uh, that has a, a set of goggles, I guess is the best way to say it, that will project um, a 3D model onto real life. So I think the term's mixed reality. So uh, it's a brave new world. Is this part of AI? <laughs> well, I mean, are I, we getting there? I, I think we will. I think we will get there. I, I think for the construction industry, what you'll see with artificial intelligence is uh, automating really mundane tasks that people are doing over and. And over again, like editing a drawing or running an accounting report. That's what we'll see in the future. Well, we're talking about, you know, projects and workflows and all of this stuff that kind of becomes mundane after a while. But what does it do for a company like Trimble? You have to stay on top of that whole ledge. Uh, you do. I think what we, what we have to always do is focus on who is it that we work for. Right. It's the men and women in the field, ultimately. Right. Right. So we make tools for and software for companies that work outside, you know, and that includes construction, obviously. So I think to stay on top of the technology is one thing, but it's another thing to also stay on top of the customers and what, what they're doing and make sure we're supporting their everyday life. Well, what kind of feedback are you getting from customers towards like new software and that sort of thing? I think that you know the layperson doesn't realize just how technically savvy a concrete contractor is. And you've right. been doing this a long time, right. so so you know. And it's amazing to me. Yeah. So the feedback, uh, it's not like wow, I can't believe you can do this, which which is a positive thing. That they they have an open mind and they think anything is possible. And we've been sort of just on a steady drumbeat of developing new things every yeah. year. And so the the main feedback we get is, hey, thanks for doing that, keeping the pressure on and. And, and continuously developing your offerings. Is there any particular element that you see uh, this business going, at least as far as construction is concerned? Is, is it software? Is it hardware, like with your innovation of your hard hat? It's is both. It that, so, is it really? It's both. The, the hard hat, you know, it's a hardware thing, obviously, right. but yeah. it's also very much a software thing. Uh, I think the trend that we're seeing and, and something that we're trying to push the envelope on is push the information as far forward to the work base as you can get it. Right. Get it into the hands of the people that need it. Most of the money that gets wasted is when people are standing around wondering what to do next. And what's what's causing right. them to wonder is they don't have the information that they need. So, and, and I think, you know, when you think of a total station to lay out a building, yeah. what, what is it doing? It's just taking information and helping you make it, it. it, condensing it and helping you make it sure. real. Yeah. You know, where is this thing yeah. situated in the world? Right. Well, it's very interesting. Your line of work has got to be very intriguing. It is. I started off as a concrete contractor, so I'm not a sort of a technology guy by trade, but um, never a dull moment. And I have the best customers in the world. I try to think about if I was selling software to lawyers, I probably wouldn't, wouldn't like it as much, but we have the best customers on, on the planet Earth. Oh, that's good. Andy Dickey, appreciate you stopping by, taking time out of a very busy schedule. Stop by and talk to us about everything that's going on at Trimble. I appreciate it. Thank you. All of that from World of Concrete 2018.